Christian. From the country, Abisa, you. From Brother Ronnie's church. Brother Ronnie? Yes. I like that guy. Changes! She's not here. Now you're busy, Ronnie. Brother Ronnie, what's your name? Get the mic. Now you're going to get the mic. Okay, uh. How are you? I'm okay. They say you look beautiful. Thank you. Indeed, you look beautiful. Thank you. Okay, uh, Francesca number 11. Yes. What do you do? I'm a student at Cavendish University. What's your name? My name is Muruji Kiyopatra. How old are you? I'm 23 years old. What course do you do? I'm doing IT, Bachelor's in Information Technology. What year? I'm in year two. Year two, that means... Yes, first semester. Next year you'll be graduating? Yes. Okay. Now, contestant number 11. Yes, please. If you consider yourself beautiful, do you consider the rest of the other women in here beautiful? And why? Yes, I do consider everyone, every lady inside here beautiful. Because we are beautiful in different ways. It depends on uh, it depends on character. Some people consider the appearance. Some people consider the conduct. So everyone is beautiful in her own way. Is there any bit of ugly? No. It's a no. Okay, contestant number eleven. Tell me something. If you won the next day as Miss Uganda. Kavi, or Miss Kavi Uganda. Yes? Yes, sir. You will be a representative of Uganda. Yes. Ugandans will, re will respect you. Yes. Your fellow students will respect you. Yes. You should say amen to that, you know? Yeah. You should say amen to that. Amen. Indeed. Okay, tell me something. Why Miss Kavi in all pageants? I really had a passion of representing my country as a, of representing my country Uganda as a Miss Kavi ambassador in other countries. How best can you represent Miss Kavi in other countries? I can represent Miss Uganda. I can represent Miss Kavi in other countries through. Stopping the stigmatization of plus size ladies. Of plus size ladies? Yes. So, have you ever been stigmatized? Yes, I've ever been stigmatized. Give me two forms of stigmatization that you've gone through. But I've got a main door is abuse us that we eat big pig. You are a pig? Big what? That we eat big pig. Cleopatra. Yes, please. Do you answer them back when they tell you that you eat big pigs? No, I don't answer them back. I just ignore because I know that's how they created me and I'm proud of the way I am. Thank you. Now, we've not yet reached the level of picking our beauty queen. But if you got an opportunity to talk to those very people who say that you eat big pig, what would you have to say to them? Of course, I always have to say to them that I'm confident of myself and I'm proud of myself because I've been a representative of other plus size ladies. And it has brought you this far. Yes. So you're proud of yourself? Yes, I'm proud of myself. And your mom is proud of you too? She's very proud. Okay, thank you so much. You're welcome.